So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the outfit that you see in the thumbnail. So for this outfit, you are going to need the gray joggers. And if you want to know how to get the gray joggers, I'm going to leave a link in the description or in the comment section on a video on how to get the gray joggers. But once you got the gray joggers, you want to make sure that you have a rebreather or an earpiece. It doesn't matter which one, just go to ammunition and buy either a rebreather or an earpiece. And you want to remember, as always, we are going to be doing the transfer glitch, which means you're going to be losing all your outfits except for only one. So before you start, make sure you equip the outfit that you don't want to lose. Once you're ready to start the glitch, come to the clothing store, set your spawn location to last location, hit your pause button, go to online, and go to swap character. So one more time, you are going to be losing all your outfits except for only one. So before you start, make sure you equip the outfit that you don't want to lose. So once you get loaded inside this room right here, you're going to go over to your setting character. Underneath your setting character, it's either going to say edit or delete. If it says delete under your setting character, just go ahead and delete your second character and two new characters should walk in and you should have the edit option for your setting character. Once you got the edit option for your setting character, just go ahead and select it. And when your setting character is going, you're going to get this alert right here. Just go ahead and accept it. Once you get inside of here, if your second character ended up being a male, change it into a female. If it ended up being a female, just go ahead and leave it as a female. Go ahead and save it, continue, make a random name for it, and take the picture. Once you take the picture, it's going to go ahead and load you inside of a new session. So once you have got loaded inside a new session, the first thing you want to do is hit your pause button, open up your map, and you want to check to see if there are any clothing stores in your session. If you see clothing stores in your session, just go ahead and make your way over to the nearest one. But if you don't see any clothing stores in your session, all you got to do is go to online and find a new session or just switch sessions and the clothing stores are going to be inside that new session. So one more time, if you do see clothing stores in your session, just go to the nearest one and if you don't see any clothing stores inside your session just switch sessions or find a new session and the clothing stores are going to be inside that new session so once you've made your way over to the clothing store first you want to go to the top section go to bomber jackets and you want to buy the black hinterland varsity jacket so just come to the top section go to bomber jackets and buy the black hinterland varsity jacket So just go ahead and buy this one right here. Once you got that, you're going to make your way over to the pants section. Go to sport pants and you're going to buy the spotted muscle pants. So it should be the first ones as always. So just come over to the pants section, go to sport pants and buy the spotted muscle pants. Once you have that, you're going to make your way over to the shoe section. Go to the boots and buy the pink, the hot pink cowboy boots. So just make your way over to the shoe section, go to the boots and buy the hot pink cowboy boots. So 
so these right here once you have that you want to go ahead and make your way over to the accessories and if your female character has any earrings on make sure you take them off because some female characters do spawn in by default with earrings so if you also has earrings on make sure you go ahead and take them off so once you've taken off the earrings, you want to go ahead and make your way over to the cashier lady and come save the outfit. And when you save it, you want to go ahead and save it in an empty slot that's on your main character. So the outfit that you didn't want to lose on your main character was in slot 20. You'll just save this in a different slot. So just save it on the empty slot that's on your main character. So once you've saved the outfit, just go ahead and hit B or circle to back out, go to standard outfits and buy the Chica outfit. Once you've got the Chica outfit, just go ahead and completely back out, hit your pause button, go to online and you want to go inside of creator. Once you get loaded inside a creator, you want to go ahead and click on create a race and you want to click on land race. Once you get loaded inside of here, click on race details, go ahead and fill out the title and the description. It doesn't have to be anything specific, I just put in random stuff for it. After that, just go ahead and take the photo, put the maximum players on 2 and set the root type on point to point. Once you got that, you want to hit your pause button, open up your map and warp over to the airport. Once you get to the airport, you just want to go ahead and hit B or circle your back button, click on placement, click on place triggers, just go ahead and place it down, back out of that, click on lobby camera, go ahead and take it, and then back out of that and click on checkpoints. Now it doesn't matter how many checkpoints you place down, as long as the race is 0.62 miles or longer. So just go ahead and make the race 0.62 miles or longer. Once you've done that, hit your back button twice, so be a circle, just hit it twice and it's going to give you the option to test out the race and you just want to go ahead and test it out. Once you finish the race, you're going to get this completed alert, just go ahead and accept it. Once you load in, just hit your pause button, go to online, and you want to click on choose character. Once you get loaded inside this room right here, you're going to go over to your second character and you're going to delete it. So make sure you delete your second character. You don't want to delete your main by accident. Make sure you go over to your second character that has the Chica outfit on and you're going to delete her. Once you delete your second character, two new characters will walk in. From there, just hit your back button. So just hit B or circle and it's going to take you inside of single player. Once you get loaded inside a single player, all you're going to do is just hit your pause button, go to online, go to play GTA online and just go inside of a invite only session. So all you're doing in single player is going inside of a invite only session.
So when you get loaded inside your online session, first thing you want to do is make sure you save your outfit because it's not going to be saved. So wherever you spawn at, make sure you save your outfit because it's not going to be saved. And also when you save it, you want to go ahead and make sure it's saved towards the bottom so it doesn't get in the way when you're trying to merge your other outfits. But once you saved it from there, all you need is the gray joggers. If you're not sure to get the gray joggers, I'm going to leave a link in the description, like I said, or in the comment section on how to get the gray joggers but i'm gonna be back when we get the um gray joggers so once you've got your gray joggers like me right here all you want to do is um take the top off and you can put on any shoes it doesn't matter it's going to change to the um sports shoes anyway so just have your gray joggers on with any sneakers once you've got that just hit your pause button go to online go to jobs play jobs rockstar created go to versus and you're going to start up crooked cops once you're in the settings for Crooked Cops, make sure you put the clothing on player own or the glitch will not work. So once you get inside of here, make sure you put the clothing on player own. Once it's on player own, you can either invite one of your friends or wait for a random to join. Once you guys get loaded inside of here, just go down to owned outfits and hit right on the D-pad once. And you should have the um, jersey on with the gray joggers and the um, sport shoes. From here, just go ahead and ready up. So once you guys get loaded inside of the mission, all you want to do is open up your interaction menu, go to your styles, go to your accessories, and put on either a rebreather or an earpiece. Doesn't matter which one, just put on a rebreather or an earpiece. Once you've got that, open up your phone and quit the job from your phone.
once you get loaded inside your online session you should still have your outfit on from here you just want to go ahead and come save it inside of ammunition once you save your outfit you can go ahead and delete the component for it because you don't need the component anymore so just come save the outfit and delete the component so that's gonna be it for this video if you guys enjoyed it don't forget to drop a like on it share and subscribe if you already haven't and don't forget to turn your post notifications so you don't miss out on future videos